Welcome back. Today's recipe, Chicken Mashed Potato Bowls, offers a lot of versatility. You can choose any type of chicken to cook any way you like. I pick some bone-in skin on chicken breast and I bake them just with some salt and pepper on. You can choose a whole chicken to roast, you can deep fry chicken, you can do boneless skinless chicken in a skillet pan. It doesn't matter. It's your choice however you like. I'll then be dicing about two pounds of yellow potatoes. I'll put them into a pot of cold water. I'll bring that up to a boil and let it cook for about 10 to 15 minutes until the potatoes are tender. I then take a skillet pan and I put it over medium heat. I add in two tablespoons of olive oil and one 16 ounce bag of frozen green beans. I cover it and I let it cook for about 9 to 10 minutes, stirring in between. I then take a small saucepan over medium heat and add in 2 tablespoons of olive oil and 2 tablespoons of flour. I'm creating a roux, so I let it cook for about 30 seconds to a minute while I'm whisking it the entire time. I'll then slowly add in two cups of stock. Chicken or vegetable will work here. You'll want to whisk continuously so you don't end up with lumps. This is going to be your gravy. Next, I'll be adding in some fresh cracked black pepper, a quarter teaspoon of onion powder, and then half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Lastly, I'll add in half a teaspoon of salt, plus more to taste if needed. Then take your lid off your green beans and let them cook for a bit that way. I prefer mine browned. Then add a little salt. Next your mashed potatoes should be done, so drain those. Add in two tablespoons of butter plus a quarter cup of milk. Then salt to taste. Once you've given your potatoes a good mashing, you're ready to dish it up. I know, I had set a bowl and I'm using a plate. It's what I grabbed. Also, this recipe is great for packing, so I filled up one of my thermoses and had it ready to have on the go. So there's chicken mashed potato bowls. I hope you like this video and give this recipe a try. Thanks for watching!